1 Chronicles chapter 5 verses 18 through 26. The sons of Reuben, and the Gadites, and half the tribe of Manasseh, of valiant men, men able to bear buckler and sword, and to shoot with bow, and skillful in war, were four and forty thousand seven hundred and threescore, that went out to the war. And they made war with the Hagarites, with Jeter, and Nephish, and Nodab. And they were helped against them, and the Hagarites were delivered into their hand, and all that were with them, for they cried to God in the battle, and he was entreated of them, because they put their trust in him. And they took away their cattle, of their camels fifty thousand, and of sheep two hundred and fifty thousand, and of asses two thousand, and of men an hundred thousand. For there fell down many slain, because the war was of God. And they dwelt in their steads until the captivity. And the children of the half-tribe of Manasseh dwelt in the land, they increased from Bashan unto Balermon and Sinir, and unto Mount Hermon. And these were the heads of the house of their fathers, even Ephur, and Ishi, and Eli El, and Azri El, and Jeremiah, and Hodaviah, and Jadiel, mighty men of valor, famous men, and heads of the house of their fathers. And they transgressed against the God of their fathers, and went a-whoring after the gods of the people of the land, whom God destroyed before them. And the God of Israel stirred up the spirit of Pul king of Assyria, and the spirit of Tilgathpulneser king of Assyria, and he carried them away, even the Reubenites, and the Gadites, and the half-tribe of Manasseh, and brought them unto Halah, and Haber, and Hera, and to the river Gozan, unto this day. 1 Chronicles chapter 6. The sons of Levi, Gershon, Kohath, and Merari. And the sons of Kohath, Amram, Ishar, and Hebron, and Azel. And the children of Amram, Aaron, and Moses, and Miriam. The sons also of Aaron, Nadab, and Abihu, Eliezer, and Ithamar. Eliezer begat Phinehas, Phinehas begat Avishua, and Avishua begat Bucky, and Bucky begat Az, and Az begat Zerahiah, and Zerahiah begat Marioth, Marioth begat Amariah, and Amariah begat Ahi Tub, and Ahi Tub begat Zadok, and Zadok begat Ahi Maz, and Ahi Maz begat Azariah, and Azariah begat Johanan, and Johanan begat Azariah, he it is that executed the priest's office in the temple that Solomon built in Jerusalem, and Azariah begat Amariah, and Amariah begat Ahi Tub, and Ahi Tub begat Zadok, and Zadok begat Shalom, and Shalom begat Hilkiah, and Hilkiah begat Azariah, and Azariah begat Sariah, and Sariah begat Jehozadak, and Jehozadak went into captivity, when the Lord carried away Judah and Jerusalem by the hand of Nebuchadnezzar. The sons of Levi, Gershom, Kohath, and Merari. And these be the names of the sons of Gershom, Libni, and Shimei. And the sons of Kohath were, Amram, and Ishar, and Hebron, and Azel. The sons of Merari, Mali, and Mushi. And these are the families of the Levites according to their fathers. Of Gershom, Libni his son, Jahath his son, Zima his son, Joah his son, Idu his son, Zerah his son, Jedari his son. The sons of Kohath, Aminadab his son, Korah his son, Asir his son, Elkanah his son, and Abiasoph his son, and Asir his son, Tahat his son, Uriel his son, Uzziah his son, and Shal his son. And the sons of Elkanah, Amasai, and Ahimoth. As for Elkanah, the sons of Elkanah, Zophai his son, and Nahoth his son, Eliab his son, Jeroham his son, Elkanah his son. And the sons of Samuel, the firstborn Vashni, and Abiah. The sons of Merari, Mali, Libni his son, Shimei his son, Azah his son, Shimiah his son, Haggai his son, Asaiah his son. And these are they whom David set over the service of song in the house of the Lord, after that the ark had rest. And they ministered before the dwelling place of the tabernacle of the congregation with singing, until Solomon had built the house of the Lord in Jerusalem, and then they waited on their office according to their order. And these are they that waited with their children. Of the sons of the Kohathites, he man a singer, the son of Joel, the son of Shemuel. The son of Elkanah, the son of Jeroham, the son of Eliel, the son of Toa. The son of Zuf, the son of Elkanah, the son of Mahath, the son of Amasai. The son of Elkanah, the son of Joel, the son of Azariah, the son of Zephaniah. The son of Tahat, the son of Asir, the son of Abiasoph, the son of Korah. The son of Ishar, the son of Kohath, the son of Levi, the son of Israel. And his brother Asaph, who stood on his right hand, even Asaph, the son of Barakiah, 
the son of Shimeah, the son of Michael, the son of Baseiah, the son of Malchiah, the son of Etni, the son of Zerah, the son of Adaiah, the son of Ethan, the son of Zima, the son of Shimei, the son of Jahath, the son of Gershom, the son of Levi. And their brethren the sons of Merari stood on the left hand, Ethan the son of Kishi, the son of Abdi, the son of Malak, the son of Hashabiah, the son of Amaziah, the son of Hilkiah, the son of Amzi, the son of Bani, the son of Shamer, the son of Mali, the son of Mushi, the son of Merari, the son of Levi. Their brethren also the Levites were appointed unto all manner of service of the tabernacle of the house of God. But Aaron and his sons offered upon the altar of the burnt offering, and on the altar of incense, and were appointed for all the work of the place most holy, and to make an atonement for Israel, according to all that Moses the servant of God had commanded. And these are the sons of Aaron, Eleazar his son, Phinehas his son, Abishua his son, Bukki his son, Azi his son, Zerahiah his son, Merioth his son, Amariah his son, Ahitub his son, Zadok his son, Ahimaz, his son. Now these are their dwelling places throughout their castles and their coasts, of the sons of Aaron, of the families of the Kohathites, for theirs was the lot. And they gave them Hebron in the land of Judah, and the suburbs thereof round about it. But the fields of the city, and the villages thereof, they gave to Caleb the son of Jephunneh. And to the sons of Aaron they gave the cities of Judah, namely, Hebron, the city of refuge, and Libna with her suburbs, and Jatir, and Eshtemoa, with their suburbs. And Hillen with her suburbs, Deber with her suburbs. And Ashan with her suburbs, and Beth Shemesh with her suburbs. And out of the tribe of Benjamin, Geba with her suburbs, and Alemeth with her suburbs, and Anatoth with her suburbs. All their cities throughout their families were thirteen cities. And unto the sons of Kohath, which were left of the family of that tribe, were cities given out of the half tribe, namely, out of the half tribe of Manasseh, by Lot, ten cities. And to the sons of Gershom throughout their families out of the tribe of Issachar, and out of the tribe of Asher, and out of the tribe of Naphtali, and out of the tribe of Manasseh in Bashan, thirteen cities. Unto the sons of Merari were given by Lot, throughout their families, out of the tribe of Reuben, and out of the tribe of Gad, and out of the tribe of Zebulun, twelve cities. And the children of Israel gave to the Levites these cities with their suburbs. And they gave by Lot out of the tribe of the children of Judah, and out of the tribe of the children of Simeon, and out of the tribe of the children of Benjamin, these cities, which are called by their names. And the residue of the families of the sons of Kohath had cities of their coasts out of the tribe of Ephraim. And they gave unto them, of the cities of refuge, Shechem in Mount Ephraim with her suburbs, they gave also Gezer with her suburbs. And Jokmaam with her suburbs, and Beth Oron with her suburbs. And Ijalon with her suburbs, and Gathrimon with her suburbs. And out of the half tribe of Manasseh, Aner with her suburbs, and Biliam with her suburbs, for the family of the remnant of the sons of Kohath. Unto the sons of Gershom were given out of the family of the half tribe of Manasseh, Golan and Bashan with her suburbs, and Ashtaroth with her suburbs. And out of the tribe of Issachar, Kadesh with her suburbs, Dabaroth with her suburbs. And Ramoth with her suburbs, and Anam with her suburbs. And out of the tribe of Asher, Mashal with her suburbs, and Obdin with her suburbs. And Hukok with her suburbs, and Rehob with her suburbs. And out of the tribe of Naphtali, Kadesh in Galilee with her suburbs, and Haman with her suburbs, and Kurjathaim with her suburbs. Unto the rest of the children of Merari were given out of the tribe of Zebulun, Rimmon with her suburbs, Tabor with her suburbs, and on the other side Jordan by Jericho, on the east side of Jordan, were given them out of the tribe of Reuben, Bezer in the wilderness with her suburbs, and Jaza with her suburbs. Kedemoth also with her suburbs, and Mephoth with her suburbs. And out of the tribe of Gad, Ramoth in Gilead with her suburbs, and Mahanaim with her suburbs. And Heshbon with her suburbs, and Jazer with her suburbs. Acts chapter 26. Then Agrippa said unto Paul, Thou art permitted to speak for thyself. Then Paul stretched forth the hand, and answered for himself, I think myself happy, King Agrippa, because I shall answer for myself this day before thee touching all the things whereof I am accused of the Jews. Especially because I know thee to be expert in all customs and questions which are among the Jews, wherefore I beseech thee to hear me patiently. My manner of life from my youth, which was at the first among mine own nation at Jerusalem, know all the Jews. 
which knew me from the beginning, if they would testify, that after the most straightest sect of our religion I lived a Pharisee. And now I stand and am judged for the hope of the promise made of God, unto our fathers. Unto which promise our twelve tribes, instantly serving God day and night, hope to come. For which hope's sake, King Agrippa, I am accused of the Jews. Why should it be thought a thing incredible with you, that God should raise the dead? I verily thought with myself, that I ought to do many things contrary to the name of Jesus of Nazareth. Which thing I also did in Jerusalem, and many of the saints did I shut up in prison, having received authority from the chief priests, and when they were put to death, I gave my voice against them. And I punished them oft in every synagogue, and compelled them to blaspheme, and being exceedingly mad against them, I persecuted them even unto strange cities. Whereupon as I went to Damascus with authority and commission from the chief priests. At midday, O King, I saw in the way a light from heaven, above the brightness of the sun, shining round about me and them which journeyed with me. And when we were all fallen to the earth, I heard a voice speaking unto me, and saying in the Hebrew tongue, Saul, Saul, why persecutest thou me? It is hard for thee to kick against the pricks. And I said, Who art thou, Lord? And he said, I am Jesus whom thou persecutest. But rise, and stand upon thy feet, for I have appeared unto thee for this purpose, to make thee a minister and a witness both of these things which thou hast seen, and of those things in the which I will appear unto thee. Delivering thee from the people, and from the Gentiles, unto whom now I send thee. To open their eyes, and to turn them from darkness to light, and from the power of Satan unto God, that they may receive forgiveness of sins, and inheritance among them which are sanctified by faith that is in me. Whereupon, O King Agrippa, I was not disobedient unto the heavenly vision. But showed first unto them of Damascus, and at Jerusalem, and throughout all the coasts of Judea, and then to the Gentiles, that they should repent and turn to God, and do works meet for repentance. For these causes the Jews caught me in the temple, and went about to kill me. Having therefore obtained help of God, I continue unto this day, witnessing both to small and great, saying none other things than those which the prophets and Moses did say should come. That Christ should suffer, and that He should be the first that should rise from the dead, and should show light unto the people, and to the Gentiles. And as He thus spake for Himself, Festus said with a loud voice, Paul, thou art beside thyself, much learning doth make thee mad. But He said, I am not mad, most noble Festus, but speak forth the words of truth and soberness. For the king knoweth of these things, before whom also I speak freely, for I am persuaded that none of these things are hidden from him, for this thing was not done in a corner. King Agrippa, believest thou the prophets? I know that thou believest. Then Agrippa said unto Paul, Almost thou persuadest me to be a Christian. And Paul said, I would to God, that not only thou, but also all that hear me this day, were both almost, and altogether such as I am, except these bonds. And when he had thus spoken, the king rose up, and the governor, and Bernice, and they that sat with them. And when they were gone aside, they talked between themselves, saying, This man doeth nothing worthy of death or of bonds. Then said Agrippa unto Festus, This man might have been set at liberty, if he had not appealed unto Caesar. Psalms chapter 6. O Lord, rebuke me not in thine anger, neither chasten me in thy hot displeasure. Have mercy upon me, O Lord, for I am weak. O Lord, heal me, for my bones are vexed. My soul is also sore vexed, but Thou, O Lord, how long? Return, O Lord, deliver my soul, O save me for Thy mercy's sake. For in death there is no remembrance of Thee, in the grave who shall give Thee thanks? I am weary with my groaning, all the night make I my bed to swim, I water my couch with my tears. Mine eye is consumed because of grief, it waxeth old because of all mine enemies. Depart from me, all ye workers of iniquity, for the Lord hath heard the voice of my weeping. The Lord hath heard my supplication, the Lord will receive my prayer. Let all mine enemies be ashamed and sore vexed, let them return and be ashamed suddenly. Proverbs chapter 18 verses 20 through 21. A man's belly shall be satisfied with the fruit of his mouth, and with the increase of his lips shall he be filled. Death and life are in the power of the tongue, and they that love it shall eat the fruit thereof.